Rodriguez is brought into Richmond Police Headquarters. But the charges against the 21-year-old are anything but childlike. Rape in concert, which cops say carries a potentially stronger sentence. And police say these two teens are part of that orchestrated rape. Oh, that's my nigga. The white t-shirt is from Panola and just 17 yeah. years old. Yeah. The 16-year-old next to him attends Richmond High. Shut Police up. say they did more than rape the 15-year-old. Her victim was raw. She was beaten. In fact, sources close to the investigation say the girl's cell phone was taken from her on this patio and allegedly used to call other boys who arrived to either participate or cheer on the attack. And the number is staggering. 30 is the number that where we are. But cops admit they flipped oh, yeah. witnesses, getting them to turn in suspects. And that led to this house, directly next door to Richmond High School, looking for Salvador Rodriguez. No one answered our knock, but sources say as investigators knocked, Rodriguez placed a call to cops with this claim. I want to tell you what happened. I'm not involved. So police sources say Rodriguez phoned and told investigators to meet him here at this top park at 26th and Humphrey. But instead of surrender, he allegedly bolted. But he didn't get far. Cops tackled him quickly, placing Rodriguez under arrest. The rest of the dragnet was here at this home in San Pablo. Police sources say they found some compelling evidence. Condoms that matched those found at the rape scene. Oh, sources say what? not only was the condom uh, brand identical, but clothing was discovered at the house dude. that matches the description given by the victim. That was Robert Lyles. That's ugly. That's ugly. San Jose tonight, people will see? get their chance to discuss.